All right, here we are, day 21. It is almost Christmas. We have, oh, there's some stamps. There's some dies. Let's see what we have. There's three presents, stamps, and three dies that go with it. Oh, well, that could be fun. Let's see what we can make with this. All right, so here's our stamps and dies from today. To me, these kind of say birthday card. So I pulled out the happy and birthday from the other day. And then I went and I cut and colored a bunch of the stamp and dies. So I wasn't sure how exactly this was going to play out on a card. So I wanted to make sure it was all going to fit. Then what I think I'm going to do is put them on a five by seven. So I have a four and three quarters by six and three quarters blue piece. And then this was from a subscription box from Crafters Companion. And so that is four and a half by six and a half. Let me move these out of the way. Now the first thing I'm going to have to do is get everything lined up on here and stamp the birthday. So I was thinking, I put foam on the back of these and some of it is an eighth of an inch and some of it is sixteenth of an inch. Because I was thinking I would put it on here at different heights. Something along this lines, just to give it a little bit more interest. And then I would stamp the happy birthday in the middle. So this die will come here. Something along this lines. And then the birthday will have to get stamped here. So I need to make sure I have everything placed where I want it to be. And then I can stamp the birthday. I think something along this lines. All right, so that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna stamp birthday right about here. And the happy will be over to the side a little bit. All right, so let me bring in my stamping platform and bring this over here. Make sure I have everything where I want it. Final decision here. Bring that down. Make sure that's straight. All right, that looks good. All right, so carefully move these are off. There's the happy. And let me stamp this. All right, there we go. Put this back. And let me die cut the happy. All right, so here's happy. Get that out of here. There we go. Get my pokey tool. That will work too. this off. Hopefully this has had a chance to dry now. Because that looked a little wet. Alright, so we're going to have happy here. And let me put these back on. And so I have foam on the back. So I have thick foam, thinner foam, thick foam, and thinner foam. So they're at different heights. Once I get them all attached, I'll show you. I'll put it up sideways and you'll be able to see. All right, so let's attach these. And then I will put the happy on. I don't want them all going in the same direction. This one will go that way. So 
So since this one is going this way, I'm going to put that one the other way. So that way they're different heights in different directions. Now let me glue on the happy. Here's my fine tip bottle. And we'll just dab some glue on the back here. Tap it, spread it out a little bit. And well, the H is a little bendy, so I want to make sure the H goes on where I want it. There's the H. I have glue on my hand. Let me even this out. So look at it. That looks good. All right, now let me glue this to the blue. Yeah, I colored them ahead of time because I think you've seen me color enough things this month. And I wasn't sure how many I wanted to put on there. But the eight seemed to work. I thought about putting them in a circle. Um, but then I decided just to go up and down the sides. So a wreath would have been cute, too. All right, so we'll put that here. And this will go on here. And this card will be finished. all that off. Oh, that's a little crooked. There we go. Now it's straight. And if you wanted to know what colors, and the colors I used were R37, R05, Y17, R02, YG63, and B95. And like I said, now I'm going to tip it up here so you can see what I did with the foam. So they're different heights. You can see it better this way. So this is on 1 8th and this is on 1 16th. And I just alternated it. All right, so there it is. If you liked it, give me a like. Give me that thumbs up that YouTube likes so much. And if you want to see the rest of these videos as we get ever closer to Christmas, only a couple days left, subscribe and you can get a notification every day when I post these. And until tomorrow, stay crafty.